A Virginia state senator says that he wants to do something to make sure the nightmare on I-95 last week never happens again. Yeah, that idea is to limit truckers to traveling only in the right lane when it snows. Fox 5's John Fitzgerald along I-95 in Dumfries. All right, Fitz, you spoke with both the senator and some truckers. What are they saying? Well, the idea is the uh, brainchild of state senator uh, in, down here in Fairfax County. Now, he says... He wants to make sure through a bill that truckers stay on the right side of the road when it snows. The reason State Senator Dave Marzin says he wants to lower speeds on truckers and hopefully avoid some of the crashes we saw last week that led up to that 45 mile standstill. Everybody, uh, 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 you know, feels like somebody else is, is responsible when something bad happens. But let's face it, Tom, this is a pretty, pretty minimal ask. Uh, for those to be cautious, and uh, uh, and, and I think hopefully uh, the drivers will do it. Well, the Virginia Truckers Association still hasn't taken a position on this bill yet. They see they say they want to see it once it is introduced. Now we did talk to some truckers who were on the road about this today. They say it doesn't make sense, and they feel they're being blamed by what they say was a failure in the spate response. You can't blame the truckers and make it harder on truckers just because accidents happen. It's, it's nuts. If we are only stuck to one lane, yeah. then it makes it difficult for us to make a uh, on-time pickup and on-time delivery. They want to try something, but they don't know what to do. What? Nobody pays attention anymore. It's because of these things. This is why the accidents happen. Turns out Senator Marzen said this could be enforced through a $100 fine to be enforced by either local or state police. The State Department of Transportation, meanwhile, says they have now launched an investigation into what went on on the road and the state's poor response. We're live in Dumfries tonight. We'll send it back into you.